it's Saturday, and I have a few questions for myself. Your name? Sophia. Your web page? TheStrangestQuark.tumblr.com What have you been up to this past year? I've mostly been surviving high school. I've also been doing astrophysics research and becoming a nerd fighter. How much longer do you think you'll be doing what you're doing? Well, I only have to survive high school for one more year. Yes. Astrophysics research? Well, right now, I'm just trying to finish my paper. Mostly just formatting it. I'm going to finish it today. And I anticipate that I'll be nerd fighting forever. Why are you doing it? I'm surviving high school because the other option would be not surviving. That doesn't sound like a great option. I'm doing astrophysics research because it's fun. And I'm nerd fighting because I'm made of awesome. What do you want to be doing? What's next in your life? I have an internship this summer. Then it's senior year and then college. Thank the Lord. How you doing? No, 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 no. How you doing? What's the best book you read this year? It's a three-way tie between Lolita, The Tin Drum, and Paper Towns. Describe a perfect day. I have an awesome breakfast, canned peaches, pancakes, french fries, french toast, and eggs, lots of eggs, bagels. Then I do something really awesome outside, like canoeing with my friends. And then we teleport to Venice, and we eat Italian food while walking around the city. My perfect day involves a lot of eating. When we teleport home, there's a really intense thunderstorm. And we all run around getting absolutely soaked. And we have a dance party in the rain. Then we go to see Spring Awakening because it has magically reopened on Broadway. Then I go home and I have a really good cup of tea, like a latte. And then I stay up all night reading a book. Assuming that all things come to an end, how do you think humans will go extinct? How are you feeling about kids these days? Sometimes they're unbelievably cute, but most of the time... What is the nerdiest thing you own? This. I love my companion cube. Ambroso tastes better than anything else. What does Ambroso taste like? Ambroso tastes like chocolate cake, but better. If that's possible. If you were a cliché, what cliché would you be? Cool as a cucumber. Jokes as a cucumber. Is that a cliché? It's cold. It's not cool. What is your least favorite part of any given day? Waking up. Do you enjoy science fiction? I don't. I somehow can't achieve a willing suspension of disbelief when it comes to science fiction because it's like pretending to be science. The exceptions are Serenity. It's really self-referential, but it's also just a good movie in general. And Starship because it's this, it, 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 I, 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 I can't speak about it. It's too awesome. Cheese or chocolate? Chocolate. Where would you live if you could live anywhere? A major city in Europe. Amsterdam or Geneva. What was your first concert? The Philharmonic. If you could start a business that would be instantly successful, what kind of business would it be? This is not a business that gives out peace. It is a business that increases awesome. It would be one of those adorable little like coffee shop bookstore places. It would be nerd fighter themed. All of the servers would be puppy sized elephants. Invisibility or time travel? I would take both invisibility and time travel, but since all the time turners are broken now, I'd have to just stick with the invisibility cloak. Invisibility is close to actually happening because we want to use it to kill people. What's wrong with the world? I'm going to be optimistic and say that it's nothing we can't fix. What's wrong with the world is not enough people are fighting world suck. Melody, I will see you tomorrow.